All right, good afternoon, Twitch, YouTube. How you doing today? If you're wondering what this is, I'm Darren. I've been using this VR treadmill right here for the last two and a half years now as my main form of exercise. Uh, you can, oh, normally you can see stats below, but I actually just have my steps for today below because that's how I do. Um, I usually, I'm, I record multiple episodes in a day. But right now, I can still exercise twice a day. Uh, we'll see what happens when RTO kicks in in January. Um, I'm filming this right when a large corporation announced that it's switching back to full RTO. So much so that the announcements for it are... Ooh, I'm gonna die. Yep. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. As soon as it ha Like, I normally can do that, but I don't think I can right now. Because I'm level 1. I don't have the health to survive falls. Ah. Anyway. Uh, yes. So... Here we go, I am doing the thing. Um, been using this treadmill for two and a half years now, so I'm in form of exercise. And uh, yeah, it's been good. It's been real, it's been fun, it's even been real fun. Um, the treadmill's great for avoiding dizziness. Running like that with your thumbs would probably get you dizzy. Nope. Cancel out of that. Just like if you keep running when you're in a menu. <laughs> That'll get you dizzy too. <laughs> but, uh. Yeah, I gotta really change this. I gotta just get that off of magic. Alright, cool. Anywho. Uh, you can. Oh, normally you can see stats below, but I actually just have my steps. For today below because that's how I do. Um, I usually I'm, I record multiple episodes in a day. But right now I can still exercise twice a day. Uh, we'll see what happens when RTO kicks in in January. Um, I'm filming this right when a large corporation announced that it's switching back to full RTO. So much so that the announcements for it are. Ooh, I'm gonna die. Yep. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. As soon as it ha like I normally can do that, but I don't think I can right now. Because I'm level one. I don't have the health to survive falls. Ah anyway. Uh yes, so here we go. I am doing the thing. Um been using this treadmill for two and a half years now, so I'm in form of exercise. And uh yeah. It's been good. It's been real, it's been fun, it's even been real fun. Um, the treadmill's great for avoiding dizziness. Running like that with your thumbs would probably get you dizzy. Nope. Cancel out of that. Just like if you keep running when you're in a menu. <laughs> That'll get you dizzy too. But, uh... Yeah, I really changed this. I gotta just get that off of magic. Alright, cool. Anywho. Uh, yes. Anyway, yeah, uh, uh, it avoids the dizziness. It's great for immersion. It is great for cardio. And if you're thinking of picking one up, I highly recommend it. In fact, uh, after about two years, I became an affiliate. Affiliate link below. Code NEVERFORGE, capital N, capital F, gets you 130 bucks off. But the only downside to a treadmill is that it is, in fact, a treadmill. <laughs> is it great for cardio? Yes. Great for running? Yes. Is it great for upper body strength development? No. I'm going to go sleep. I'm going to go sleep in here. Um, is it great for upper body strength development? No, of course not. It's a treadmill. They don't do that. I've got your back. So... For strength development, I have this bow. This set to, oh, please tell me it actually let me sleep. Nope. Can't touch anything, even by accident, or else it messes that up. Uh, this bow is set to, I wanna say it's 53 pounds today, I don't remember. 55 maybe, I can't tell. I can't see through the ground. It's right there, but I can't see it. 
Um, but anyway, whatever it says down there is correct. Uh, <laughs> and that is how I get my upper body strength development so that I'm not just doing cardio. Which cardio is more than most people get playing video games. And there you go. And that's what it looks like. I shoot the bow. It shoots the arrow. It does the thing. And that dragon was level 20. Ridiculous. Alright. So I've got some number of steps. Let me count them right now. 1816. So we're going to keep up 1816 steps. And I'm going to start running. So 1816. Boom. Now I'm going to run to Iverstead to go find the old man at the top of that mountain, and we'll see how far Iverstead is from Carthspire. Yeah, this was a nasty fight. Nasty fight. I mean, the Forsworn were like level 1 and level 6. Fine. Other than the spellcasters, that's easy enough. I gotta find better ways to deal with spellcasters, because I... Oof. It's nasty. But that dragon was level 20. That hag was level 20. It was a nasty experience, that. This doesn't... Let's see if I can... You're interfering with official Who are you? Formal... I am a Thormor Justiciar on important business. What are you doing in Skyrim? You are interfering... We're making sh Now go away. Ah. Let me pick their pockets. Anyway. Alright, here we go. Heading back to Iverstead and therefore um who's it? The old men. So I gotta go ask them about a thing. Whew. Don't make me shoot you, goat. Of course, what I'm doing right now is a... S is a... speed run. So what I'm trying to do is get to the end of the game as quickly as possible. My goal is to kill Alduin without leveling as quick as I can. But I gotta run everywhere. Otherwise, what's the point of a treadmill? So I can't fast travel. Can't level up. I can use skills. But yeah, I can use equipment. But I just gotta do what I can do as quickly as I can. So here we go. What's a milk drinker like? Oh, you, you shouldn't talk to me like that. Why? What are you gonna do? Back off I, now. I don't have to take that from you. Ooh, you're not worth it. Hey, watch it. I'm not worth it. I got me a bounty. She attacked me. Did she stopped fighting me? I don't know. Whatever. Right over his head. Come on. There we go. Right in his head. Gonna hate iron arrows. No more iron arrows unless I'm desperate. How desperate am I for arrows anyway? I got four ancient Nord, 103 iron, and 42 steel. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm not desperate for iron arrows at all. I'll get other arrows before. Oh, that was. Miserable. That was miserable too. Here we go. Alright. Heading to Iverstead. And yes, no leveling means no perks. Come 
on. Yeah, thank you for showing up. Yeah, no leveling means no perks. Good times. It's also my last week working before I go on bonding leave, but I'm also doing something important. I work for a game, not going to mention which game, but we have an open beta, so if anybody needs me to like do some deep dive into some data, I need to make sure I'm around just in case. More like, can I goof off for more than an hour or not? Let's make it shoot any of these butterflies. Nope. Just barely, though. Oh, thought I had that one. Legit thought I had that one. Okay, that was... Here we go. Butterfly! I'm gonna go this way because I can fight some bandits and stuff. But. Here we go. Eight hundred steps so far, it looks like, roughly. I don't know, I can't see through the ground, so. <laughs> you have to tell me. Actually, I can look at it this way. Whew. All right, let's take a look. First of all, make sure I am recording. Okay, good. Two six three seven from one eight one six. So yeah, it's like eight hundred some odd. Not bad. I feel like I just started. What time is it? Yeah. I've been going for maybe ten minutes. Not even. I'm sure that'll be an embarrassing statement <laughs> when I've edited stuff down and you actually see what it is on YouTube, but... I think once I pass that bridge, I can... run across the thing. And remember, if the world ends, it doesn't matter who dies. So, you know, shaving the world and all that. Shaving the world, is that what it is? Shave the world. No beards. No other hair either. Friction free experience for everyone. Bye bye, skeleton. I know what you're running down there for. He was off in an awfully big hurry. When I said bandits, I didn't realize. It'd be right here. Sure have mercy on you. Now you 
come on. All right, she's got him. That was the saddest bandit fight I've had in a while. Why'd I grab that arrow? I didn't want that arrow. All right. There's another one over here somewhere. She got him, I think. Come on, where is he? Where is he? Here he is. No, no good arrows. Oh well. All right, onwards. Need to be bandits. I didn't realize they'd be here. There's a camp. That's where I was planning on going. God, I need him still. I don't know why he has gold. Why does he have gold? Makes no sense. Why would they have gold? I just don't get it. Might as well use my magicka. It's the first time I lowered my magicka. I'm switching to steel arrows. Just <laughs> punch a deer in the butt. Yeah, you'll find me, alright. Put my arrow on your face. They have a book in their camp, I think. Ooh. Does he have steel arrows, or...? He has my steel arrow. That's what he has. Why do I keep grabbing skill books and I'm not leveling? I don't know. Sometimes they're useful. How'd that Imperial want? F off, Imperial. I'm not dealing with your war. I'm not doing a war here. Hilgins this way. All right. You there, please, you have to help me. I was attacked by a vampire. Do you have a potion or something that can cure this before I turn? We got a cure disease potion. Oh, thank the gods. Here, take this with my thanks. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. All right then. It's got a hundred gold for a cure disease potion. I'll take it. And no one's gonna be here. That's nice. Here we go, Helgen. I haven't seen any bandits in Helgen yet. Do you have to level up for that to happen, or is it just like... At higher levels, bandits love Helgen.
Yeah, there's dead bodies from the last time I was here. Because it's been like less than a day. As I said, I'm speeding through, so... A lot of covered ground. Okay, get your bow back out. here a second and look at my steps okay so it was three six seven three steps <clears throat> so almost a little under two thousand <coughs> to get here from thingy but i'm gonna take the 100 steps so get out of there thank you three six seven three I'll do some math when I get to the top of the top of the mountain. Let's go. So it's 732 actual steps. Like, that's a step. That's another step, right? 732 of those. But I think the ones that are two, like this, I think that's just one step in that 732 number. But there's non-stair steps as well. Let's see how many of those there are. Did I just shoot somebody? Oh, I shot a goat. Not the goat I was aiming at, but it's the goat I shot. What if the wolves reset? Still doing the steps. Even more steps. Yeah, like that's one, two, three, four, five. But I think that 732 number I quoted earlier, that's just one. I think that's how that worked. At least that's the assumption I've been making. But man, level one Skyrim is not easy. Like if this troll is here, I'm just dead. Like. <laughs> Not strategizing at all. I don't think he's here, but the troll was there. He'd be boned. Lydia is like eating my dust or snow at this point. <laughs> eating my yellow snow. What? No idea what I'm talking about. Don't eat yellow snow, kids. No matter what that kid neighborhood kid tells you, it's not lemon. Damn you, David! It's actually a much sadder reference. I did have a neighbor named David. I wouldn't say that he was a bully, but he did mess with me a little bit. 
Not in like a bad way, though. I liked him well enough. He unfortunately was gonna go help his mother move. Uh, back in 2001. Early September, he was like, taking a flight to Texas to help his mom move, and uh, from Massachusetts, where I grew up. And uh, his flight got diverted into a building, so that was sad. <sighs> Alright, here we go. Almost there. Knock on wood, no dragons. I didn't bother with the... Oh, here we go. Yeah. Might as well. Did I get them all or am I missing one? I'm always missing one. I don't know. Never find all these stupid things. Yeah. I missed one. Somewhere along the lines. Okay, here we go. Hi, Lydia. Welcome to the party. find anybody in this stupid place. Now they're all up there, chilling. That's stealing. Ah, you've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Runa. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Okay. All right. All right. I'm getting recognized formally as Dragonborn. And it's time for me to recognize formally the number of steps between here and there. I get to that room. So I gotta give it time to catch up, because the calculations are weird. You are ready to learn the final word of Unruh. Alright, let's take a look at the steps. 4998 versus 1816. So that's what? 2 and 8. This is actually easy math. 1, 3. 3182 steps. 3182 steps. Nice. Between here and. Alden's Wall. With all three words together. This shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Master Wolfgar will now gift you with his knowledge of Da. You have completed your training. Oh, yeah. We would speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. You can withstand the unbridled oh. voice of the Greybeards. You are ready. I I need to learn the shout used to defeat Aldwin. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? What do you think? Where did you learn of a shout used to defeat Aldwin? It was record recorded recorded on Aldwin's wall. The blades, of course. Yeah. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their reckless arrogance. They have always sought to turn the Dragonborn from the path of wisdom. 
Have you learned nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the blades to be used for their own purposes? The blades just want to defeat Alduin, don't you? What I want is irrelevant. This shout was used once before, was it not? And here we are Ooh, again. Tic-tac in there. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Those who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end, so be it. Let it end and be reborn. Then what's it matter if I try to stop him? So you won't help me? I have given my answer. Go and reconsider your course. Oh, hey, you're in trouble. <laughs> Someone's getting yelled at. I'm just getting yelled at hard. All right, let me. I gotta refix this. Ooh, party snacks. Uh, forgive me. I was the decision whether or not. So, I can you teach me this shout? Is not. No. I cannot teach it to you because I do not know it. It is called Dragon Rent, but its words of power are unknown to us. We do not regret this loss. Dragon Rent holds no place within the way of the voice. What's so bad about Dragon Rent? It was created by those who had lived under the unimaginable cruelty of Alduin's dragon cult. Their whole lives were consumed with hatred for dragons, and they poured all their anger and hatred into this shout. When you learn a shout, you take it into your very being. In a sense, you become the shout. In order to learn and use this shout, you will be taking this evil into yourself. Okay. The shout is lost. How can I defeat Alduin? Only part of Nax. The master of our order can answer that question, if he so chooses. I need to speak to Parthenax, then. You weren't I'm ready. I'm my way through you this. still aren't ready. But, thanks to the blades, you now have questions that only Parthenax can answer. Who is Parthenax? He is our leader. He surpasses us all in his mastery of the way of the voice. Alright, why haven't I met Parthenax yet? He lives in seclusion. He speaks to us only rarely. And never How do I get to the top of the mountain to see him? Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Alright. That's cool. I'm gonna go learn party snacks. I'm gonna go meet party snacks. I'm gonna do that next time because that is what I do. I'm gonna break this up into two because that seems like the best course of action. Let's I figure out where the hell I'm going. Ah, yes. Is the courtyard. Are we heading out there now? Alright, as I head out to the High Hrothgar courtyard, I'm gonna say talk to y'all later. Um, this is the time for me to sign off, so, or at least to end this YouTube video so that they don't get too ridiculously long. All right, peace out, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch, check me out on YouTube. I've been I'm gonna be releasing these videos at noon every day. If you want to see me go meet party snacks, check out tomorrow. And oh my God, five five oh two nine steps. Actually, I think the number of steps then is higher than I was giving you credit for because I didn't do that many steps in there. So 5029 minus 1816, I'm going to just do some rounding, that's roughly 2,000, that's 3,000, some odd, 3,200 steps. So 3,200 steps between here and there.
All right, peace out, everybody. Like, sub, hit all the buttons, do all the things. And for those of you on Twitch, don't worry, I'm still here. Uh, yeah, peace out.